Good day, my name is Blue Suit, and today I'll be going over my review of the Steel Series Apex Pro. The Apex Pro is a top tier mechanical keyboard from Steel Series that features a detachable rubberized magnetic wrist rest, a smart OLED display, and first of its kind adjustable mechanical switches. It's a wonderful jack of all trades keyboard that is exceptionally durable, functional, and comfortable while standing head and shoulders above its competitors and only trailing the industry in a few minor features. We're going to get into all that, but before we do, if you are interested in picking up an Apex Pro for yourself or have any questions about any other SteelSeries products, you can find links to their website and product page in the description below. Now, I'm not affiliated with SteelSeries in any way, and I don't make a commission or anything like that, but they're there for your convenience. With that out of the way, the first thing I want to get into is what I noticed right out of the box, and the first thing was this huge non-detachable USB cable coming out of the back of the keyboard. The Apex Pro has a very convenient pass-through USB port at its head, but in order to supply power to it, there's a quarter-inch thick USB cable that forks at the end with one end powering the USB port and the other powering the actual keyboard. It's quite rigid and it's going to take several weeks before it's actually going to lay flat on your desk. Fortunately, however, as I said, the extra nearby USB port has proven useful several times since it arrived, and on the underside of the keyboard, there are even three different channels to give you a few different routing options to manage the oversized cable. The other two things that I noticed right out of the box were that one, the keyboard feels very sturdy with its aluminum frame and hefty weight, and two, the magnetic wrist rest that comes with the Apex Pro isn't just a plastic rectangle attached to the bottom, but it actually has a very nice, smooth rubber feel to it. The first thing to do after plugging in your new Apex Pro is to download and update the SteelSeries engine, the companion app that comes with the keyboard. This will allow you to reassign whatever keys you want, build complicated macros that perform multiple functions at once, or spruce up your Apex Pro with near infinite illumination settings. The aluminum frame of the keyboard has the similar unpleasant feel as a chalkboard, but it works well to reflect the light from the keys to enunciate the display happening from under them. The Apex Pro isn't the brightest RGB keyboard on the market, but its design allows for a much more mellow style of lighting. The SteelSeries engine has a boatload of features that make this keyboard unique, but the most exciting are the apps within the engine. For starters, there are several applications that allow you to customize your illumination settings beyond the normal standard settings. So for example, as your ammo gets low in CSGO, lights on your keyboard will start to go out. Or as you regain health in Minecraft, the red keys on your keyboard will start to light back up again. There are a ton of games that this works with, and even several apps that utilize the OLED display. This great idea can show PC data like CPU usage and temperature, game data, and media information as well. The only issue with it is that you really need to be sitting up and almost over your keyboard to be able to see the screen due to the height of the keys on the board. It is another nice way to customize your Apex Pro, however, as it can display any 128 by 40 pixel image to include animated GIFs. Adjacent to the OLED screen is a media scroll wheel and button that not only allow you to change the volume and track of the music that you're listening to, but also allow you to enter the quick settings of the keyboard to change illumination settings, macros, profiles, and one of the best parts of the Apex Pro, the key actuation. Touted as being the first keyboard to be able to do so, the SteelSeries Apex Pro can actually change its key's depth actuation settings for its entire board or even each key individually, making it perfect for light and heavy-handed players alike. Between 3.6mm and a crazy 0.4mm activation point where the keys will almost activate just by blowing on them. It achieves this by using magnetic sensors instead of actual buttons at the base of the keys. So when you're adjusting the actuation, you're actually deciding how much magnetic force the sensor needs to actuate the key. It's a really cool idea and SteelSeries boasts that it will give these keys up to a 100 million click lifetime. On top of that, they are not only super satisfying to press, but they are also some of the most comfortable keys that I have used on a keyboard. If you're someone like me who does a lot of writing or programming or schoolwork, as well as gaming, this is definitely one of the more comfortable keyboards you can use without transitioning over to an actual ergonomic keyboard. You can pick up a SteelSeries Apex Pro on the SteelSeries online store for 200 bucks. It's a super comfortable and functional board that is made exceptionally well and comes with near endless features through the SteelSeries engine companion app. It's incredibly satisfying to use and has even become my own personal new main keyboard due to its performance both in and out of gaming. 
There's no doubt that it's definitely worth the $200 price tag, and I highly recommend it to gamers who are looking for a keyboard that not only looks and feels good, but they can really do it all. I hope you enjoyed this review of the SteelSeries Apex Pro. Come see me on Twitch where you can watch our reviews in progress five nights a week. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and let me know in the comments what you thought about it. Until next time, peace!